Yo, yo. Is it rural? Is it rural? How do you pronounce that again? Yo. Rural settlements in the countryside. Right. One thousand or less wanna take a drive. Some like it the best, some say it's a dive. Let's check out the patterns, that's where and why. Settlement patterns to basic types Living close together or taking hikes You just might want the fancy words The terms are concentrated and dispersed When concentrated you might settle on a road Or maybe on a river to take a boat This is called linear cause you're settled in a line But roads and rivers curve so it's not straight all the time Population distribution is covered now Close or far and linear, why and how? You got a question though? Oh, you wanna know how many in a square kilometer? So let me show what you're asking is called density, not distribution. That's just the shape you see. Ten people concentrated or ten spread out. Different distribution, but the same in density, no doubt. Rural settlements in the countryside. One thousand or less wanna take a drive. Some like it the best, some say it's a dive. Let's check out the patterns, ask where and why What affects these patterns, let's go in depth and check to see the key factors When we inspect, we find the facts, common sense So don't forget, resource, transportation and government Yeah, A resource is what you got, forest or oil Makes a difference if you're mining zinc or tilling soil Transportation shows how your settlement grows Are you taking trains or driving on concession roads? The government might have a few things to say Deciding and dividing lots with the land survey Rules like build like this, split the land in squares Farmers are allowed 40 up to 80 uh, hectares yo. Rural settlements in the countryside right. One thousand or less wanna take a drive Some like it the best, some say it's a dive Let's check out the patterns, ask where and why Let's look at three places from the book 227 through 230 done in a hurry uh, Southern Quebec, Southern Ontario uh, And the Southern Prairie settlements all in a row Quebec wanted access to Riverside Cause they traveled by boat or frozen over sled rides So the lots were all skinny but really long Called the long lots of Quebec, now let's move on Southern Ontario, the government said Don't do it like Quebec, let's use roads instead So they made a grid of concessions and townships Baseline, side roads and numbered all of it check the southern prairies knew what to do next borrowing the section system from the u.s land divided in 94 square kilometer blocks feeling lonely was a problem though with these huge lots uh. rural settlements in the countryside 1000 or less wanna take a drive some like it the best some say it's a dive Let's check out the patterns, ask where and why. You also got resource-based settlements, service settlements. I mean, we can keep categorizing these all day. That's pretty much the whole chapter.